Here's the midday update for August 10th, 2011. Again, on the S&P 10 day chart, looks like the crash wave is completed. The third wave got a four yesterday at the close, and looks like we're going to five down. But in intraday, it looks like there's wave one, wave two up intraday. And if S&P drops below 11.25 today, then it would set up a downward three into the close. Probably a, a panic type of sell, panic type of selling. So that'd be wave one, wave two, and and again, if it takes that 11.25 at the close, it'll set up a downward three. But to the upside, if we can take that 11.55, then it will set up an upward three. Right now, it's like it's 50-50, but since the market is down a lot, I'm anticipating the drop below 11.25 by the close. For Nasdaq, same thing. Go the crash wave, fourth wave, and a fifth wave. But in the intraday chart, looks like wave one, wave two. And it drops below 23.90 again. Let's set up a downward three. And again, since the trend is down, I am anticipating a um, probably another flush out at the close. If, we, if Nasdaq can drop drop below 23.90, if some by some miracle it takes out 24.57 to the upside, I'm gonna set up an upward three. But if I was, uh, this is not a 50/50 shot. This is more like 70/30 that we go we, that we that we um, flush out at the end of the day. For the Dow, third wave completed, fourth wave, and fifth wave down. But in all in all the three cases, though, we're in a fifth wave down, so I really don't think it's a good idea to go short. I mean, maybe for a very, very short intraday trade, but um, Dow looks like it has wave one, wave two intraday, and if it drops below 10,780, it's set up a downward three into the close. But um, again, I would just, personally, I'm just going to watch this, um, this wave go by because Fifth waves are un unpredictable, but uh, this is standard fifth wave and breaks through the yesterday's low, then you can probably get a meltdown at the close. But um, again, this could be three, four, and five. So when this thing reverses, it, it could reverse just like we did yesterday. So I wouldn't be uh, aggressively shorting at the close. Uh, again, Nasdaq three, four, five, S&P three, four, five, crash wave three, four, just perfectly standard, and a fifth wave down. It's a wrap.